Hello everyone, I'm Malika Jolly, a professional makeup artist. Today's video is on one of my favorite topics, makeup products with multiple uses. Just the sound of being able to use a single product in a number of ways is super exciting. The next few tricks will be very helpful as I'll be telling you a few products that you can use in multiple ways. For example, how you can quickly transform your eyes, lips and cheeks with just one single product that you can carry in your bag with you all the time. So let's start with the first super basic trick. Making the most of your lipstick and I will be using the MAC matte lipstick in the shade Meher. Apart from using it on the lips, our mothers have used it numerous times on us as kids as a quick fix on the cheeks as a blusher. And now it is a trend. Apply a tiny dab of lipstick to the apple of your cheeks. Then pat it in using your fingertips. This will give a natural flush of color. Lipsticks can also be used all over the eyelids as an eyeshadow. Use a soft peach pink or nude brown shade for a natural everyday look. Choose a matte lipstick for longer lasting results. You could also use frosted shiny lipsticks in nude shades as a highlighter using the same application technique. The next product with multiple uses is an eye pencil. I'll be using the Bolly Glow Duo Eye Pencil which has a black and a brown end. The black end is classically used as a kajal and eyeliner but it can also be used to create a dark smoky eye. On the other hand, the brown end can be used to create a soft smoky eye to enhance the lower lash line or to fill in your brows. The brown end can also be used for contouring your face. You need to apply in small dots and blend. The third product with versatile uses is a highlighter. I have the Maybelline Master Chrome highlighter here with me. Apply the highlighter on the cheekbones, brow bones, nose, cupid bow and also on the collarbones. A separate eyeshadow palette is not always easy to carry. The highlighter can be used on the eyelids as well as on the inner corners of the eye. Using a highlighter on your lips can make them appear bigger and fuller. Apply a dab in the center of the lips and then blend. You can mix a liquid highlighter with your moisturizer or foundation to give a natural glow effect. I love how I just completed this look using only three makeup products. I use these tricks very often and they are a part of my regular makeup routine. Hope you find them useful too. Until then, stay smart, stay beautiful. Whether you wear makeup on a daily basis or occasionally, every woman has her stock of lipsticks that she turns to while getting ready. This video will quickly highlight 6 MAC lipsticks that I believe are a must-have. MAC lipsticks are super pigmented, have great longevity, amazing quality and a signature fragrance. It is a brand that offers a wide range of lipsticks and there is a shade and finish for everyone. So let's see how these shades look. The first shade I will be showing you guys is the Velvet Teddy. This is one of the best nude shades and it is great for daily wear as well as to pair up with a smoky eye. The second shade is called Please Me. It's a pretty pink shade that's perfect for the no makeup nude everyday look. So let's see how this looks. The third one is Meher. It is famously called the dirty pink shade. I would say more like a dull rose. So let me quickly try this on to show you how great the shade looks. The fourth shade that I have is flat out fabulous. It's a bright fuchsia shade perfect for a night out and just like its name it makes you look fabulous. So let's try it out. The fifth shade which is one of the most popular is Ruby Woo. It's a classic universally flattering red which is a must have for everyone. 
Sixth and the last shade is called Rebel. It's a gorgeous cool tone berry plum shade. So let's check this one out. A quick tip, always choose a lipstick shade that suits your skin tone. The right shade will immediately give you a confident look and you will know it. I hope you find this video useful. Until next time, take care, stay safe, stay bold and beautiful. Lipsticks can make you look fresh and bright and today I will show you the correct lipstick application technique to make you look fabulous. Is your lipstick bleeding or fading soon after you apply it? It could be that you are not applying it properly. I will now outline a few simple steps for you to apply your lipstick like a pro. Always remember to start with a good base. If your lips are dry and flaky, exfoliating them will remove the dead skin helping the lipstick to stay longer. Moisturizing your lips will not only make them soft and smooth but will also help the lip liner and lipstick to go on more evenly. I'll now prime my lips with a foundation to remove any discoloration. I'm using the MAC Studio Fix Fluid in the shade NC15. A lip liner is very important. It gives the lipstick something to grip onto and makes it last longer. It also prevents the lipstick from bleeding. Next, we will apply the lipstick. Always choose a lipstick that complements your skin tone. Now, we'll blot the inside of the lips, which will help the lipstick from getting onto the teeth. We can make our lipstick last longer by dusting it with some powder and then applying the second coat. Lastly, we will clean the outer edges of the lips using some concealer. This not only gives a fine crisp outline to the lips but also prevents the lipstick from smearing. And now I don't have to worry about this coming off for hours together. The key is simply to practice and experiment with colors, shades and techniques. Remember, do not overdo the application. Following these steps once or twice will make you a pro in achieving those perfect lips. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Until next time, take care, stay safe and don't forget to pout. For more fashion tips, subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon.